plan to add more campsites to the Auburn Recreation Area was approved today. It comes despite vocal opposition from a number of local organizations and neighbors. ABC 10's Mike Duffy has a closer look at the controversy. Aye. 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 Okay, the motion passes with five votes. And with that, the California State Park and Recreation Commission approved the General Plan and Environmental Impact Report Thursday to add up to 142 new campsites to the Auburn State Recreation Area. But not before dozens of members of the public, almost every caller voiced their opposition, citing the potential for increased fire danger. We don't want to be the next paradise. We don't want to be the next river fire, which started in a designated campground that consumed 142 homes and structures. Our El Dorado County Supervisor doesn't want this plan. Our Placer County Supervisor doesn't want this plan. The Park Commission did end up adding an amendment to the plan, promising to make Cal Fire an integral part of any plans that were developed, as California State Parks Commissioner Phil Ginsburg summarized. Requires you to request Cal Fire's review and then for Cal and then to come back to the commission to uh, with the, the management plan. Yet John Michelini, president of the Forest Hill Fire Protection District, is staunchly opposed to the plan. The idea that adding more humans to the park would result in less fires is completely uh, inexplicably wrong. And he says the history of fire here is concerning. In the last 12 years, <clears throat> there have been seven fires of significance in the Auburn State Recreation Area, including the 2016 Trailhead Fire. Each of those seven fires were human caused. My goodness, commissioners say the approval of the plan does not mean the new campsites will be built anytime soon. They say plans must go through several levels of approval and then the state must also approve funding.